आई एम डॉक्टर मकरंद पांडे आई एम क्रॉप ब्रीडिंग मैनेजर फॉर टोमैटो ईस्ट वेस्ट सीड एंड वर्किंग इन ईस्ट वेस्ट सीड एंड दिस कंपनी इज वेजिटेबल सीड कंपनी स्टार्टेड बाय वर्ल्ड फूड प्राइज लॉरेट मिस्टर साइमन ग्रुट एंड इट वाज स्टार्टेड इन फिलीपींस अराउंड फोर्ट ईयर्स बैक एंड दिस कंपनी स्टार्टेड इन इंडिया अराउंड सिक्सटीन ईयर्स बैक and uh, we are basically in uh, vegetable breeding and vegetable business our major crops are uh, bitter gourd uh, then uh, rich gourd then pumpkin is our major crop uh, uh, there are several uh, solanaceous vegetable crops like tomato and then pepper and uh, i am basically uh, uh, working on uh, tomato i came to know fasal once uh, when i was in pune and uh, one of the tomato crop and uh, uh i i got uh, inspired from that the information uh, farmer was getting from fasal then we installed this uh, in our field almost 3 uh, months back uh, when this crop was planted and uh, to tell you how useful this instrument is actually just uh, after planting i was getting continuous uh, messages uh, what is the soil moisture what is the climate or all what pest or what disease is going to come for example uh, this year we got very heavy rainfall and most of the tomatoes nearby they uh, got uh, suffered because of uh, uh, heavy lead blight but uh, because of prior information that uh, there is possibility of uh, lead blight uh, coming in your tomato and then we spread and uh, for tospo also uh, we used to get information that thrips might come so my field assistant regularly spread as per the message uh, from uh, uh, fasal so this has helped me to to protect my crop uh, from uh, severe diseases pests so i think uh, i will recommend this to farmers and uh, this is definitely useful especially for a small holder farmer i will say because those farmers doesn't know what exactly uh, uh, they should spray they just go to uh, uh, pesticide shop and uh, they buy chemicals but uh, fasal tells us what exactly chemical you have to spray and definitely that will help to reduce the number of sprays and uh, uh, that will uh, help to save uh, the money input cost will be saved and automatically the profit of the farmer will be increased i think this is very useful and uh, i definitely recommend for so, all uh, uh, vegetable farmers ellarigu namaskara nan hesaru raghavendra anta nanu tomato crop alli kelsa maartta idini field technician age namma breeder age makran panda sir anta nam munche fazal akakke nam munche tomato crop alli kelsa maartidvi aga nam boss nam boss agidda makran panda sir avara margadarshan dantene kelsa maadbekagitto avaru helidu prakarane kelsa maadkonbeka hogbekagitto और हेली टाइमे या प्रिप्रेशन होती सड़न मा बरती मत या प्रिप्रेशन आती स्वल्प लेट आगो अदे तौंद आगो अद्र अदे फसल हाकि नमें उपयोग आगे अद्रे अंतर यह अब क्लैमेट कंडीशन वारद मुंचे इला वारदेले मुन फोर्टीन डेस प्रिप्रेशन तोर्सते हद्नाक दिन मा बे वार मा बे ना ना मा बे आर कंडीशन तोर्सते अद्र प्रकार ना फसल आप नोड़को ना मा बे अरे इवते नावे या प्रिप्रेशन मी अद्र जो मत इरीगेशन मा बरकिन मुंचे इरीगेशन मत तेवांश जास्ती है इला अोर्सते टेमे नहीं कल्तक मत बड़े बेस्ट कंडीशन पेस्ट कंट्रोलू मत डी कंट्रोल तोर्त है टेमेन क्लैमेट कंडीशन प्रकार तोर्ता है अद्रे वे उपयोग आती है नमें हाई मई सेल श्रीकांत वड़गवे ऐम वर्किंग इन एस पी आर डिपार्टमेंट ऐस ए मैनेजर प्रेसेंटली वी हव इनस्टा फसल डिवैस इन प्रोडक्शन एरिया इन वन इन कर्नाटक एंड वन इन महाराष्ट्र प्रेसेंटली इन वी इनस्टा इन हाट पेपर क्रॉप्स It is very helpful for uh, daily activities, since from land preparation to harvesting, it gives uh, around 14 days weather data. Based on that, we can decide whether we have to do our operations uh, and we have to plan our operation well and before. And it it is very much helpful for our uh, d- uh, irrigation activities, speci- uh, especially when to irrigate, how much irrigate, whether we have to irrigate or not. By installing a fossil device. 
uh, we saved around four to five irrigations compared to without fossils. Uh, if you uh, take another advantage means it will help uh, for our, the, our uh, weather forecasting data. It will help uh, for our uh, operations like uh, uh, pollination activity. Uh, based on fortnight weather forecasting, we will decide whether we have to start pollination uh, or uh, not to start. Major uh, cost incurred in the seed production is uh, in pollination activity. It will help in uh, cost saving in terms of labors also. And the third one is in terms of uh, spraying. It will advise which uh, pest and disease infected by our crops and which uh, chemicals we have to spray and when to spray. Uh, based on this, we have saved around uh, five to six spraying, cost incurring chemicals as well as spraying uh, for labors. Uh, this is the major advantages and based on this, we uh, will decide uh, harvesting also, whether we have to, uh, based on weather data, whether we have to harvest or not to harvest. Uh, this is very much helpful for uh, our uh, seed production operations uh, in daily activities. This fossil, we came to know about this fossil through our management. Earlier we were having a lot of challenges in seed industry. How this system is helping us? So, for example, based on the weather parameters, we are preparing our land. For example, if the rain is coming tomorrow, then we will prepare our land today itself. Thereby, we are saving our time. Similarly, for spraying also, we are getting a lot of information. For example, if there are any pest incidents in the crop, it will say this pest, particular pest is there. Based on that one, we are going for spraying. Even it gives us the direction when to spray, what chemical to spray, uh, and what dosage to spray. Thereby, we are saving a lot of time, resources, energy, as well as money. Hi, uh, I'm Teeth. Uh, my role in East West is uh, integrating uh, tools and technology to core breeding. One, one such uh, technology is uh, fossil. Besides the benefits uh, we got it from this device by the description of my colleagues, so one of the opportunities what we are looking at uh, uh, fossil is uh, uh, the advisories which gives can be used in, uh, in, a, in a placement of our hybrids so that you know, farmers can select the right hybrid based on the existing uh, uh, climatic conditions. That's called uh, you know, uh, resilient uh, climate technology, we call it as. We have a portfolio of hybrids which are suitable for a particular disease outbreak or maybe a moisture strength. So all that kind of you know uh, selection of hybrids can be suggested to the growers based on the advisories uh, which we get from uh, uh, fossil. So it's going to have a bigger impact to the farming community and in particular to the industry like uh, uh, east-west uh, in, uh, in uh, breeding activities. Thank you.